Yeah, I've had a passion for the outdoors for a long time. The bug bit me when I was real young. Whether it's coyotes or turkeys or rattling big bucks in, it all does something to me. And... rabbit hunting with dad, bird hunting with dad and the grandpa, uncles, and I just love the outdoors, there's nothing better. My first time alone coyote hunting, uh, walked from the house, made a set, called in a double, missed them. Walked to another set, called in a single, missed it. I think I called in seven coyotes that morning and walked with my head hanging low all the way home and didn't have a single coyote with me so yeah what was it like three years ago we started hunting together yeah three or four three or four we uh i remember our first set together set up on this bluff and first thing we called in was big old tomcat yeah got the old shotgun uh, then yeah. we went right over the hill Got that big male. Big male coyote you shot on the run. He'd come in and seen us sitting there. Yeah. We were kind of sticking out like sore thumb. That's kind of where it started. We both knew what was mm -hmm. going on. Kind of had a general concept of where we needed to be and right, what we needed to do. Yeah, right then and there I knew we were on the same page with coyote hunting. Like nothing was out of the question what we could do. You know, we both knew what to do, when to do it, and how to do it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, just like I said, that first cat, um, I looked at you and said, hey, I need that shotgun. I'm on the short side. You yeah. said I was thinking the same thing. I knew right then and there that this was going to be a start of something right there that was going to grow big.
the thrill of predator hunting for me is the adrenaline rush. Um, it's kind of action-packed all the time. Sometimes it's not. And there's nothing better than calling an animal in for me. Um, the challenge of it. Yeah, the challenge. There's always something different. Yeah. You never know. It's all going to be different. Um, you get into a certain groove and it works for you for a while. Then all of a sudden you got to change your tactics because the weather changed mm -hmm. the time of the year. And I love outsmarting them. And that's my favorite thing probably to do is to call a coyote in or bobcat even at that matter. But it's... It's a drilling rush for sure. There's a lot of havoc involved. There's a lot. There's a lot of havoc involved. Every uh, good boat needs a name, so yeah, got a name of something. <laughs>